Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you want to enjoy condensed milk pancakes just like Henry here, just please keep on watching. Let's get started. So you need 350 grams of plain flour and then you need to add in half a teaspoon of salt. Next, add in half a teaspoon of ground nutmeg. Add in 80 grams of melted butter or margarine, whichever you prefer. Next, crack in three eggs. Three medium eggs is okay. Okay. So this recipe is very similar to the previous one, just that we use condensed milk. So you need a Parix uh, measuring bowl in which you add in one can of sweetened condensed milk. Next, you need to add in about one and a half of water. So if you have this measuring bowl, I would say that add water until the level gets to 800 to 850 mils. Because one thing you need to know about this pancake is that um, it's thick. So you need to add water to dilute the uh, condensed milk, just as you see here. Okay. So you might need to even add a bit more water depending on how you want the thickness to be. So when you are happy with it, you can then add in the condensed milk and water mixture to the egg and the flour. Okay. And then you need to mix it until it is very smooth. So if you have noticed in this recipe, we did not add any sugar because condensed milk is already sweetened enough. So when you are uh, blending it or mixing it, make sure you scrape the, the bottom of the bowl uh, so that there is no lumps, okay? And once you are happy with it, everything is nice and smooth. Keep it aside and heat up a frying pan. When the frying pan is hot, you can brush it with some vegetable oil, not too much. Uh, if you have a kitchen brush like this, it will be easier. If not, you can use just some kitchen towel. And by the way, this recipe also works with uh, margarine. So if you want to use margarine instead of uh, oil, please go ahead. Next, when the oil is hot, scoop in one spoon of pancake butter or crepes. Okay. And then let it cook or let it fry for about one to two minutes and then flip it over so that the other side can also um, cook. So this recipe is uh, easier than the other one because there's no sugar measurement. So I would say it is uh, less sweeter. Okay. And uh, also one thing you need to know is that this recipe is drier than the usual pancake recipe, but it is still as good as the other one, just that this is um, another alternative. So once the pancake is ready, just roll it and place it on a plate and carry on with all the remaining of the pancakes. So we just wanted to let you know that there is also an alternative to make pancake or crepes with um, condensed milk. And this is the recipe. So we hope you enjoyed the recipe and we'll see you next time. Bye.